production. What, what was the difference there? You know, it's funny, the calls weren't that much different. Uh, I think we came out a little bit and the bright lights got us a little bit. You know, I think our guys, we normally aren't like that. We don't have kids that are like that. They don't, they don't get nervous. I think they're a little bit afraid to make a mistake to start that game. And then the speed multiplied that and the skill multiplied that. They just settled down half. And I, I owned some bit. I actually done a little bit better job in the first half. They told me, I'll, I'll help you out. You guys got to go start doing what you do. You know, we ran the ball better. We were more physical you know, in the second half. But the calls weren't any different. It was the same defense. You guys were obviously practicing at tempo all the time. Uh, but was it, what was that like to actually have to defend Oregon and, and its speed along with its tempo? You know what it gets you? It gets you when they get momentum and they're having success. The tempo itself, you know, lining up, we didn't we did not line up on any down today. Now that's one thing you see a lot of people do. They don't get lined up. They don't have their hand on the ground. They're not aligned to play. We didn't have any of those issues today. What happened was the momentum got us a little bit and they started going. They started feeling pretty good about themselves and our kids kind of got jarred up. You know, there was about two or three series there where their tempo forced our kids' composure to disappear. And, and it crippled us. In the second half, it didn't happen at all. We knocked them off schedule, right? They tried to go fast, and our kids said, okay, bring it fast again. We knocked them off schedule again. You know, so we, our composure was kept a little bit better. I don't think we had a problem on up their tempo all day. But, but, but the issue was the momentum that came from them having success play after play after play. And we couldn't get a break from it. You know, we're not one of those teams that's going to fall down and fake injury. And I wanted our kids to fight their way out of that. We just didn't do a good job that first half. And you were bringing the heat, you know, you sacked Mariota really hard along with Phil Thomas. Because of the, what was leading to the turnover? Uh, and, and that's the it. You know, that's the whole thing. We talk about, yeah, people will say, how do you get takeaways better from last year? How do you, you know, I've got that question about 50 times. You, you know, you can work takeaway drills. All that stuff's nonsense. You know what it is? It's attitude getting to the football. Because you saw us getting around the ball more, right? You saw us being having a bunch of guys around the ball. When a bunch of guys are around the ball, takeaways out. You, know, you have guys screaming off the edge with confidence, and they trust where they're going, which they didn't do in the first half. And plays happen like they did. You know, I mean, we should have hit that guy two or three more times. We should have, you know, fell off a couple of sacks that maybe we should have had. But it was just guys feeling more confident about what they were doing. I don't think we had that confidence to start the game.